Hey everyone, uh, new uh, behind the scenes look at Godzilla vs. Kong here, uh, as I have on screen. Um, there's While there's nothing like too majorly crazy, there is a good handful of new footage and extended shots. Uh, so, basically, um, we're going to go ahead and break down everything. Not too many new plot details here, I will mention some of the stuff they say during it, but again, there's not much. Um... But yeah, no, we got we got all sorts of new we got we got some new footage and some new extended shots, uh, and we also have stuff like this concept art in the background. Now, as you can see, it's this is basically the quality of all of them. We'll try our best, but you can't really expect much. Um, but yeah, so let's start. So here's some more concept art in the background. They'll show some more later on, but as you guys can see, it's about as good as impossible to try. This red one in the corner, if you guys can see my mouse, is one that's sticking out to me a lot. I'm trying to figure it out. I believe this concept art right here, that's Godzilla and that's Kong, I feel like. And I feel like there's something in the Apex lab. But yeah, like I said, a lot of it's so blurry. It's literally just... It's just guessing. Like, you can't really exactly determine anything. This stuff is also interesting to me, too. Because what this makes me feel like is either... Remember King of the Monsters when they were looking at Godzilla when he supercharged? To me, this either represents him, something about to blow up, like a nuke, like the radius of a nuke or something, or some sort of, like, radiation sort of uh, thing. You know, like where in King of the Monsters, you could actually see his radiation, like, spread out after he went and supercharged. But yeah, no, the way it's looking, I'm curious if this is some explosion. This is probably an Apex lab. So, this makes me really interesting if Mechagodzilla has some sort of, like, nuclear pulse ability. I'm curious if that's what that is. Here's some new footage right here, as you guys can see. Tons of bright neon lit colors. Alright. Uh, nothing too crazy there. But, here's some more new footage right here. Right here, they're saying that Kong needs their help. Uh, you can't really see him. Anywhere in this footage, I don't th believe. Uh, I'm trying to look, but it looks like it's just all stuff destroyed. It's could be when Kong's underwater. And they kind of say they need to help Kong. They need to do something to lure God Godzilla away or kind of slow him down. We get a nice extended shot here of Godzilla roaring. So, as you guys can see, beautifully extended. Tons of more. It's, it, lo it looks a lot better now that I can see it like this. Here's Adam Wingard. Same concepts background as Iza had. I believe it was Iza, but not much there to work with. I think this shot slightly extended. New shot of Millie and them. And the Neon Elevator. Probably, again, this is probably them in the Apex Lab. I'd be shocked if not. Um, the way they look up, I would be. Sh I wouldn't be surprised if they were looking at MG. Extended bit, kind of, of Kong in the Hall Earth. Not really extended. It's like an entirely new shot. And... Man, Kong looks beautiful in this movie. I, I think they did a really good job with Kong's design. Um, we got this shot of Godzilla. Now, this is technically new. This is actually... Oh, actually, I think it's extended too because you see his eye. Uh, you see the green in one eye or in the other. I think this shot is technically new. I think it's, like, technically new. Could be wrong. But... The reason, or not could be wrong. The reason why it's technically new is because when we saw it in the TV spot, it was leaked. This isn't a leak. This is officially released. So now this shot's officially released, and this is the first official time we've seen it. Um, here, TV spot was a leak. Uh, here you can see Kong uh, roaring back. Beautiful eyes. You can. I love the detail of the neon and his eyes and stuff. I'm trying to see if there's Godzilla in it. You can see some of the buildings and stuff, but... I'm having a really hard time telling if you can see Godzilla. But Kong looks great, too. Um, this could be the start of their fight. Here's an extended shot of Kong hopping in the Hall of Earth here. Nice wide shot. This is absolute, This is like wallpaper material. Just Kong standing in the Hall of Earth. And look at the background. The hills coming down. This looks like volcanoes right there. This is absolutely gorgeous. They did a great job with Hall of Earth. An absolutely fantastic job. And I cannot wait to see more of it in the movie very excited um some new shots of uh g, g and them you can see kong tapped out in the background there uh completely 
a lot of people might might miss that, but you can see Kong completely fucked up in the background. Um, Gia walking up there, all of them talking. Not much there to work with, other than just some. A lot, there's a lot of new human shots like this. <laughs> like, I still don't know what the hell is going on here. He's got this really like awkward run, like he's trying to get away, but he's not doing a very good job. I also think this might be the Hall of Earth. I'm trying to see if I can. Okay, so just the way the cave and stuff is, I think this could be the Hall of Earth. Could be something like a heavey going off. I don't know. Actually, on second thought. Okay, so on second thought. That looks like Kong's fur in the background. So that could be actually Kong knocked out in the background. And something exploding on his chest there. So that is pretty interesting. Um, so I actually did not notice that before. Huh. I can't say what this scene is because there's a guy who did leak this. I'm not going to lie. There's a guy who leaked what is happening in the scene a few days ago. And it just turned true. Wow, I just realized that. Yeah, that's Kong, and there's an explosion. That's all I'm going to say. Um, new shot of the Scooby gang, likely going into the Apex Lab. Uh, all their shenanigans there. Um, beautiful new shot of Godzilla. Gorgeous new shot. Godzilla looks so good in this movie. I cannot wait to see it. Um, you can see Millie looking up. <laughs> I just happened to pause it right here. Uh, Millie looking up. I assume probably at MG. You can see Julian right there. Um, Brian, Tyree, Henry, all them looking up. Again, still, still don't know what that stuff is in the background. Extended shot of MG here. I'm going to say, I'm going to have his movements. I feel like he's either flying here, which I thought before, but seeing it extend it, and she's smiling. God, she's smiling. She's having fun. That's. I wish I could have that kind of fun. Um, but, yeah, just the way you can see his arm kind of in the corner. There's a spine. Just the way he is and looking at how he's built, he has to be either flying here or I don't know what. Like, he has to be, there has to be something here. Uh, he either is flying here or he's crawling on top of buildings. Now, he could be walking through them, logically. Uh, it's just I'm questioning it because the way his body shape is from the official toys the other day, that doesn't seem to add up. Like, him hunched over. And at the same time, it's like, these buildings are like 500 feet tall, so I don't, I mean, it, there's been really inconsistent size in the monster first anyways, but it's just like, the, to me, just how big he looks and the way he seems like completely like horizontal to the ground almost, he, I think he's either flying or like crawling on buildings, which would be nuts. New shot of Mark. I think it's the second time we, oh no, we've seen him in other spots. There's some cave in the background too. I think that's supposed to be like a hollow earth cave, but extended shot of the Scooby gang. Um... Same with them cheering and stuff. Beyond this point, I don't remember if there's too much new monster stuff. But I wouldn't be shocked. Uh, yeah. I get some nice callbacks. And they also, here's some here's an extended shot of Millie and them. You see Godzilla's tail on the monitor. Uh, Gia, yeah, there is. Gia talking, doing sign language with Kong. And him looking gorgeous in the snow. I can't wait. There's actually a toy confirmed of this Kong. And I'm excited for that. Um... And, yeah, extended shot of Kong punching Godzilla. They're asking everyone what team they're on here. And, basically, everyone says Team Kong, except, like, Brian, Tyree, Henry, Rebecca, Hall. Both of them are kind of undecided. And Millie, Bobby Brown, and Shun both are, like, Team Godzilla. And, also, Julian is Team Kong because Monkey is cool. I'm not even joking. He says that. Again, here's the concept art in the background. I still think that these two might be related to MG, but I don't know. Also, before I forget... um. To me, that shot down there, I don't know what it is. It kind of looks like a Ghidorah neck to me, but I'm probably just high. It's either like a Ghidorah neck or that could be like, since it's like silver, it could be like MG and Godzilla facing off. But again, it's so hard to see since you can't see the concept art. I mean, we'll see it after the movie comes out, but extended shot of Godzilla and Kong here in Hong Kong. You can actually see Godzilla. You can actually see Kong like get closer to him. Godzilla roaring. And... Yeah, you can see Godzilla kind of get ready to do something. I don't know what he's doing here. And there you guys go. That is the new breakdown. What would you guys think of this? Please let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, as always, please share, subscribe. Hope everyone has a great day. And as always, peace out and bye-bye.